What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now it is currently 528 in the morning, and I've been working on automation videos all night. So y'all make sure y'all check out uh, Royalties Wear Everything. Um, hopefully we'll see the sun come up and I can show y'all the sunrise. But anyway, we are about to get into basically, um, Carlissa was caught in a lie, child. <laughs> She was caught in a lie. Before we even get into that, let's get into this Barbie tattoo, okay? A lot of things over the weekend I missed because, baby, I was um, outside, okay? God is great. I just, I, I've been at this computer today for about 10 hours. But um, no, ma'am, Stewie gets Barbie tatted. I like the tattoo. Um, a lot of people are feeling some type of way about it, basically saying it just should have had some color or something. But she got Barbie Ted and she said, y'all think I'm playing about this sleeve getting done by summer. So she's adding a bunch of stuff to her arm. Lord knows. I don't know what that the, the top is. <laughs> what's, what's going on with it? Uh, y'all, y'all can't see my cursor, but it looks like she got scratched or something. But anyway, let's read some of these comments. Now, let's not talk about any more tattoos when Krishan got the man who exposed her newborns, oh my God, on the internet, tatted all over her face, all, all over her and her face. Um, So bad. Usually I don't comment on things people can't change, but she's gotten so full of herself lately. This tat is giant and so dark. It It's not good. I don't know why people don't like that tattoo. I like the tattoo. Uh, that's just my opinion. Um, However, I think Jaden is living her life the right way. Jaden actually has been involved with this man for a very long time, way longer than Krishan, actually. And if you ask me, I feel like she's free a little bit, at least till he get out, because you know he's going to come hunting her down. Should have gotten Stewie instead. I mean, that's the original. You don't look nothing like a Barbie. Uh, her head done got too big. She's confused. Okay. It doesn't matter. She's not a Barbie. She's a botched up BBL job. Jesus. Barbies don't look like that, though. LOL. Bless her heart. <laughs> okay. So everybody's going ham on her in these comments. Girl, I have nothing to say. I do like the tattoo. All right, this is Carlos getting caught up in the lie. She says, no one has talked No one has talked on the phone to my son. He is still in the hole. Friend, hole, hole. Anyway, please continue to pray the Lord speaks to him. And he hears because people leaving church and lying is scaring me. So, Krishan left church the other night, which I have that live coming. And, um... Basically, she said that she spoke to him and he was out of the hole, which Krishan was correct. Um, hot tea, hot chocolate said, why do people who don't speak to him when he free continue to speak on him while he's locked up? Riddle me that. I, I am in complete agreeance with that. I've never seen two people so flustered at the fact that he is or was in the hole and while he was out free, they wasn't checking for him. I never understand it, but here we are. These are the comments. And why every time Krishan say something, she have a rebuttal. She's so intimidated by Krishan. It's sad. I agree. Now, the post story she did about Rock is gone, LOL. And it's gone because Bodine came out and called it the lie. But I'll get into it. I'm not a fan of rock, but Carlissa lies more than Krishan. I am team neutral. I say things as it is. Me too. So that's how I react to stuff. Cause sometimes I don't know. Y'all gonna take what you want to take, and that's what y'all supposed to do. We all got a job here. But I react to it as it comes and I speak on it as it comes and how it comes. And Carlissa just do the most. Uh sometimes she do the most, sometimes she be speaking facts. Today, or in this case, yesterday, she was lying. It's funny because his manager talked to him. They said Jay didn't talk to him and Rock talked to him. So why Rock is the only one line, I don't know, and everybody else ain't making, ain't making, make sense. You know, I'm going to go to the next one. I'm not a fan of Rock, but Carl is more than Krishan. Okay, this is why I don't feel bad for about her crocodile tears from yesterday. Her karma is well-deserved and she hasn't learned her lesson. Keep playing, lady. Karma is not done with you yet. All right, somebody say, oh my gosh, I wish she would shut the hell up. 
Uh, he don't even talk to you. For someone that don't like Krishan, you sure do be knowing her every move, like go away for God's sake. How would you know if she talked to him, he not going to tell you? And that's a fact. She be checking for somebody who ain't checking for her at all, which is her son. But ultimately, he's a grown man. All right. Now, Bodine posted that he spoke to Blufus. Uh, just a few minutes ago, which was prior that day, which was at 1119 in the AM. Um, Bodine has confirmed as well that he has talked to Blueface for the second time since Krishan spoke to him last night. I don't know what that noise was. And it's coming again. All right. Let's read these comments. Uh, Carlissa just be saying ish laugh my ass off we all know blue don't want to talk to her she can't even stop being messy while he locked up um y'all gonna make Carlissa explode yeah there you go Carlia I don't know talking about folks coming straight from church lying about blue being out the hole bet you feel stoop dot id dot okay you're out the loop bitty that's why you ain't even know Quit talking about Krishan for real. It's getting annoying. Leave the girl alone. She doesn't even speak on you until you've literally spoken on her a million times. You're not welcome in their lives right now and maybe never um, the way you've been. Facts. Can he please tell, can he please tell Blue's brother? He know. If the rest of us know, he know. Because he'd be like, you know, I ain't been on here, but... When I'm on here, y'all tell me whatever. All right. Hot tea, hot chocolate always does her research, baby. And Blueface housing was updated as of today, which was yesterday. He's out the hole. Um, he went in March the 1st. He got out March 16, 2024. Okay. For those, uh, those as in Dre, Dre said he want to know what his brother is and if his brother's okay. Um, he fine, Dre. It seems he is absolutely fine. He got into a quick little squabble with his brother. I mean, with uh, somebody in jail. And that is it. That is all. I don't think it's nothing else for us to see here. <laughs> I hope we good. Then after that, he says, Krishan, is my mom lying or not? <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know why this took me out. <laughs> Is my mom lying or not? He got to ask Krishan via story Instagram. Is his mama lying or not? Sir, let's let it go. Let's let it go. You don't talk to Blueface when he out. See, this is a prime example of cherish people while they are. Yeah. Because clearly y'all don't when he's out. That's why he not fooling with y'all while he in. Y'all ain't going to send him no money. You're not going to send him no love. And you don't give a damn about him when he out. I think all of us miss Blueface, even the ones that who hate him. Uh, I think we miss him more than they do, but quite frankly. I think they just miss the clout from the man. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, you know, to watch this little family feud, it's kind of sick. This type of stuff, like when you're going through it with your family, you don't really want people to know, like, how nasty that family stuff can get. Um, and theirs, it just gets nastier and nastier and nastier, okay? Um, so that's all I have to say. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, y'all. Yeah.